and she spit it out. You see how moist this is? Hello guys, welcome back to Shush Shush Talk TV. This is going to be, I guess you would consider a basketball wise behind the scenes and also some things that we predicted and Lord and behold, it is happening. But before we get started, please be sure to like this video. Also subscribe to our channel. Here on this channel, we review a lot of Bravo shows such as Real Housewives of Atlanta, when Real Housewives of Potomac was on, and we also review Married, Married at First Sight and Married to Medicine. So if those are some shows that you like or if you are interested in, this may be the channel for you. We want to grow our YouTube and also our channel. So please be sure to subscribe to our channel and also leave us a comment. Let us know what you think so far about our videos. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. So earlier on before Basketball Wives began, I predicted that Evelyn and OG, I mean, sorry, Evelyn and Jennifer were going to be bad friends. And Lord and behold, it is happening. These two ladies are back friends. And we know from watching this, um, this new season that Evelyn and OG, they are currently right now, they're like pretty much suing each other. And Ev um, Jennifer is in the odds with OG. And I guess that, you know, they're back friends. It's sort of kind of inheriting one's enemy, you know? So these two ladies that have found a common denominator, which they don't like OG, they're not feeling OG, and because of that, they have brought them together. So I guess it's inheriting someone's energy, inheriting, and it's our inheriting someone's enemy. And that is what Jennifer is doing. She is inheriting Evelyn's enemy, which is OG. So I predicted that. I knew that that was going to happen. And look what is happening. Jennifer and Evelyn are back friends. What a coincidence. Are we surprised? Of course not. We are not surprised. We have seen these two ladies. Their friendship has always been up and down, up and down. It's a matter of convenience. They have a friendship that is a matter of convenience. Currently, they have one enemy in common, which is OG. And because of that, they are they have found their way back to their friendship. So I just want to go ahead and give a shout out to the Basketball Wives T. They pretty much confirmed everything that we need to know um, about their friendship. I thought they were following each other, Jennifer and Evelyn. And also, I mean, of course, they're not. Both of them are in the odds with OG. So Jennifer is inheriting Evelyn's enemy. So they confirmed a screen. Um, capture of Jennifer. She posted a picture. She said, been pretty since 2001. And Evelyn, of course, commented and said, um, actually, sorry, J Jennifer posted a picture and Evelyn commented, been pretty since 2001. And Jennifer replied back to Evelyn. So these two ladies are back to friends. How do you feel about their friendship? Do you, were you predicting that they were going to be back friends? Because I know I was. I I had a feeling like I know these two girls are going to be back friends. So what did you think about their friendship? What do you think about their friendship? So I also want to go ahead and give another shout out to the Basketball Wives T. Um, so we get, we get a revelation pretty much confirming that Basketball Wives, there's no reunion. And there is a total of two more episodes. So after tonight's episode, there's only two more episodes. So this pretty much tells me and confirms to me that this show is going to be possibly canceled because of no one's really watching. I know the only reason why I am watching it is because I want to see how this whole thing plays out between with OG. And I'm also just um, also supporting OG as well, too. I don't watch it live. I pretty much watch it when it the replay comes on because I don't want to give them any of my little watch time or so yeah. So I'm pretty much watching it just in support of OG and the cause and also um what she stands for and I like that she is a woman of her words and she is not backing down. She's not Pretty much, yeah, backing down to any, anything that these ladies are 
accusing her of being aggressive and just being a stereotypical angry black woman um, narrative that these ladies are trying to portray on her. So that is the only reason why I'm watching, sticking around, seeing what's going to happen. But only two episodes left and also no reunion. Yeah, yeah, I think this show, it's it's seen its last days. Yeah, I think that's what, what that's what's happening with this show. But that's all for this video, guys. I will also be posting clips and also um, just um, screen captures from the Basketball Wife C. So big shout outs to them. Be um, and also, this is going to be, yeah, I think I'm just going to go ahead and wrap this video up before I leave. Make sure you are subscribed. Make sure you like this video. And make sure you have turned on your post notification button. Thank you guys so much. Peace, love, and blessings. Okay, we've been in the mansion for a couple of days. And tonight, I get to cook Nigerian foods. As you can see, I'm super excited about that. Another fun thing that I did was I got the girls' robes so that they can have a nice little icebreaker. I decided to gift everybody with robes that I bought. I put crystals on them. It's super dope. I got menus. I got puff puff. I have jollof rice i have anything and everything you can imagine i am trying to make sure that our house is the fun house okay and i'm also trying to make sure that we have a lot of positive energy and none of that negative shit from the other day i hope this goes well Yeah.